For years, the Bowling family enchanted audiences worldwide with their angelic voices and inspiring performances. Their harmonies resonated with countless souls, spreading joy and faith wherever they went. But in 2021, the Christian community was rocked by shocking news. The announcement of their divorce. This unexpected turn left Christians reeling and searching for answers. What could have possibly led to the dissolution of such a seemingly strong and devoted family unit? Join us as we unravel the complexities of this heart-wrenching saga and uncover the truth behind the headlines. But before we dive deep into their story, if you're new to our channel, we extend a warm welcome. And if you're a returning viewer, welcome back. Let's start with Mike, known as Mike Bowling, born on June 24, 1958, in the land of Bluegrass, Kentucky. Mike's musical journey began with a spark of passion that started very early. From his early years, Mike's love for music was evident as he effortlessly sang and played the piano. But it was at 16 when his path took a thrilling turn, joining the legendary Lefebvre's for a two-year stint, diving headfirst into the mesmerizing world of gospel music. Despite pursuing a degree in respiratory therapy, Mike's heart remained tethered to music, drawing him back with an irresistible melody. In 1995, he found his perfect match with the new Hinsons, his distinct vocals blending seamlessly with their soul-stirring sound. But Mike's journey didn't stop there. His remarkable talent caught the attention of the Perrys, where his voice soared on chart-topping hits like God Sent Angels and Redeemed, etching his mark on the southern gospel music scene. And then, love intervened. Mike's path crossed with Kelly, a talented vocalist from the esteemed Crab family, whose illustrious career boasted 10 Dove Awards and 16 number one songs. They decided to marry years later, and their union heralded a new chapter as Kelly joined her husband on stage, their voices intertwining in perfect harmony. They traveled together across the country, singing and glorifying the name of the God. Years later, they welcomed three beautiful daughters. Up until this point, everything was going well for the family, but in 2010, their faith was tested like never before. While on their way to a TV taping, tragedy struck as their tour bus collided with a semi-truck, leaving them with devastating injuries. Mike, cradling their youngest daughter, Caitlin, bore the brunt of the impact, suffering a brain injury, a broken arm, and other wounds. Caitlin, too, was not spared and endured significant injuries. The family was rushed to hospitals in Charlotte, North Carolina, where their journey to recovery would begin. Kelly, reflecting on the terrifying incident, recalls the moments of uncertainty and the stark realization that they were entirely dependent on God's presence. Our whole world got turned upside down on that day and we will never be the same because of that day. Despite her own broken back, Kelly found solace in her unwavering faith. After five agonizing days, Kelly was discharged from the hospital, albeit requiring a body brace and later relying on a walker. Miraculously, her condition improved without the need for surgery, a testament to the power of divine intervention. In the midst of their recovery, Mike found himself grappling with the circumstances and questioning their alignment with God's will. It was during this soul-searching period that he stumbled upon Jesus' words about Lazarus in John 11:4, serving as a poignant reminder that even in their darkest hour, there lay an opportunity for God's glory to be revealed. Kelly vividly recalls her mother's home, transformed into a makeshift hospital room, filled with the trappings of wheelchairs, hospital beds, and the echoes of months spent in physical therapy. In that trying moment, she found solace in the familiar lyrics of a song she had sung alongside her siblings for years. He will take you through the fire again. As fear cast its shadow over them and doubts lingered, the prospect of returning to their tour bus seemed daunting for the bowlings. Yet, amidst the uncertainty, fate had a different plan in store. A plan that would not only propel them to new heights, but also restore their unwavering faith in the face of adversity. After the family's full recovery, they stood up together as a united family and continued singing with more passion, love, unwavering faith, 
and an insatiable thirst for excellence in honouring the name of Christ through their music. It's a testament not only to their unparalleled skill, but also to their steadfast devotion to using their talents as vessels of hope and inspiration. As they step onto the stage of their shared destiny, the spotlight illuminates their path, fulfilling the promise of Psalm 119, 105. Your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. Casting shadows of doubt and fear aside, they walk in the assurance of Isaiah 41.10. So do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. Something unexpected happened to Mike Bowling and Kelly in 2021. People started talking about Mike's feelings for other people, not his wife. Some thought they were going to split up. Kelly had to leave their cosy blue house with their kids. Then Kelly posted a sad picture of their old home on social media. This Facebook post, shared on April 14, 2021, from the Bowling family's official account, sent shockwaves through their community. What caught everyone's attention was the absence of any mention of Mike Bowling, Kelly's husband and a crucial part of the Bowling family. This made people wonder if there was trouble between Mike and Kelly. Comments poured in, with astonishment, empathy and confusion. Many wondered if health problems, personal loss or even divorce were behind the mysterious announcement. In an attempt to address the growing rumours, Kelly's mother, Ingrid Crabb, provided some insight through a comment. She confirmed that Mike and Kelly were indeed getting a divorce, and Mike was no longer with them. However, she didn't give specifics about why Mike was absent, leaving lingering questions. In the midst of the spotlight and the watchful eyes of fans, Mike Bowling and his family have navigated a roller coaster journey filled with highs, lows, and tests of their faith. From Mike's humble beginnings as a talented musician to the tragic accident that rocked their world. The Bowling family's strength and trust in God's plan have carried them through the toughest times. Their unwavering dedication to their music, the bond of love that binds them, and their mission to spread hope through their songs have inspired countless others. As they continue to perform and touch hearts, their story serves as a reminder that in the face of challenges, faith, love, and unity, can create a powerful force that knows no bounds. Rumours of a possible reunion have circulated, but as of now, they remain just that, rumours. Only time will tell what the future holds for the Bowling family. Please let us know in the comment section who you would like us to cover next, and don't forget to subscribe for further updates.